And right after the last segment, to gotta repair you. this yet again. And for the record, Parasite wears down durability rather quickly too. I'm gonna set it back to players eight in the hopes that that'll help me level up some more. Oh God, don't. All right, good. Let's see how much more that does now. 86, 132. Wow, that's a lot. Once again, every hard point goes into strength since I'm using necro size. Oh. Oh my, there's two cave snappers. I'm just using Angel of Death to quickly escape stuff. Oh. Oh god. Oh god. Uh, yeah, that didn't do nearly the amount of damage I would have liked. Uh, oh, come on. Oh my god, really? Yeah, that poison flash is a real... Oh god. Yeah. I'm almost dead. Because I have no poison resistance. Glad I... Glad I know the, the uh, short hot key to just fill all... Fill all potions right now. All right. Ooh, Elixir of Experience. I should definitely drink that. So I need to level up some more. Already. Burning Veil again. Thank you. Thanks for dying. Angel of Death. Kill one. Oh, goodness. I know I'm really flimsy right now, but uh, I assure you I'll get much stronger later on. I don't like this. Either I'm too weak to kill stuff on player's aid, or I don't get enough experience. Damn it. Maybe I should have stayed a crossbow necro for a bit. I realize that this is not good to watch at all. Okay, come on. Oh, for fuck's sake. Alright. And I'm gonna put this scepter away. I think it's sunburn. Something like sunburn scepter. Alright. How many more left? Eee. Oh my lord, come on, die. Oh god, a cave snapper. Okay. 
Come on, you fucker. Get out of here. All right. I'm glad that was, uh, really, really... I'm glad that's a really, really good trick. Yeah, screw this. I'll scale it back to players one. I need better... Like, I just need to rush to the gift box and get a better scythe out of that. So, nothing's going to be hard yet. And got to repair my scythe again. Yep, of course. I got swarmed. Yep, still gotta use, uh... Still gotta use Angel of Death on every single enemy. I... I am convinced Angel of Death on every enemy is still the best way of going about my work right now. Okay, wait, is there a shaman up here? No. That didn't fucking kill me. All right. Come on. Just... Something die? Okay, thank you. And my weapon broke again. Good day. Repair. Get out of here, you son of a bitch. Yay, all dead. Oh. Okay. Alright, just making sure I maxed everything that I actually should have maxed yet. Okay, okay, I actually didn't remember if Massacre stun locked him or not. And now it's on players one properly. Cause I can tell because I can actually kill something. As soon as I say that, I get mauled by Poison Flash. Oh, of course. Spam Poison Flash. God damn. I know I just suck at this game in general, but... Still, I don't want to be spending all day using a um, Angel of Death. Okay, can I eliminate? No, that was not the right target. Yes, thank you. And you're gone. In Kura S3000, Angel of Death is just an amazing, amazing godsend of a skill. Since it allows you to leap over hordes of bullshit and just pretty much instant kill the totems in Kuras 3000. So you'll definitely be seeing me use that 
when I do the Anaya challenge. All right, so. Boink, and boink. So, let's see. And please go away. Thank you. Shaman, where are you hiding? Okay, Cave Snapper that will not get stunned, even though it's supposed to. Okay, Run Away, Apple, which heals me at much too slow a rate to actually do anything. Okay, come on, damn it. Oh, I need more healing potions, so... And to put away some gold, because I am not losing gold from death again. At least not now. And are you... Okay, are these fucking glowing funguses gonna die? Good. Are you... What? Wait, what the hell? Did this game's difficulty go back to players 8? No? Okay. Good. Okay, I think we can do this. I've got to repair my weapon again. Okay, good. Good. How many do I got? Two. Next time I'm in town, I'll have to remember to buy, max that out. We, okay, and, yes, okay, 14. Fifteen. Everything goes into strength, of course. And Darkwood. Alright, so once I kill Griswold and release Deckard Kane, that'll definitely be where, to e where I'm going to end the segment. Okay. And Good day. fill up on those. Okay. Good day. Good to see you. Okay, I'm gonna get swarmed. 
because I can't kill stuff quickly enough. Parasite would definitely fix that problem. But, oh yeah, I don't have that yet. Level 15. Oh goodness, Corruptors. Yeah, instant kill with uh, the field of poison. I knew that was gonna happen too. See, that right there, I think, kind of shows that this game is a lot more difficult than the original D2. And it requires more skill, which I don't have. I wonder if Angel of Death would work very well on these guys. Okay, good. Stupid Harlequins, get out of here. Out. Okay, thank God. Okay, I was gonna say, is that the tree of Enifus? Apparently not. Okay, I'm just checking my skill tree because I'm trying to determine what to max out once I hit level 24. I don't know what to max yet. I know Parasite, Death Lord, Embalming, and dra Dragonfire Oil, and uh, um, Famine, but I don't know if I'll max Talon's Hold yet. Here's how I'll... Okay. If I have points left over, I will put them in Talon's Hold for right now. Later on, I won't be investing a single point in that, because it won't be necessary. Alright, Mana Recharge Shrine, don't need that. Health Shrine, I might need later. Gonna be one of those where the waypoint's hard to find. I hope not. Well, there's the tree. That's the tree. There's Wrath Raven. This tree shines with inner spirits. Yeah, in case you can't tell, I played with the Necro quite a bit in old D2. Like, in the original game, I pretty much only ever played Necromancers and Barbarians. I did build a Boazon up to like level 85 in the original. I am curious to see if... Actually, I'm not even gonna pretend I don't know. Boazons are fucking awesome in Median, just as they were in the original. Except in this one, in Median, they're even stronger. They're uh, less durable, but they can kill way faster. Alright, so. Alright, so. I'll far. I will off screen grind until I get uh, the unique bone splitter from the gift box. After I kill uh, Griswold, of course. Uh, 
Ah. This is a good place to farm for experience. Although I think it was in the original game too, because people would make Tristram runs in, uh, on the... Technically not dead, but no reason to go there. Um, battle net. Because now all it is is just bots spamming bullshit and bots playing the game for whoever created the bot. That's all it is, and that's what turned me off the original game. Okay, so here we get random helm, I think. Random body armor and random uh, necro weapon. If you value your life, Leave here immediately. Okay, so... Yeah, off-screen I will get uh, the unique bone splitter and maybe Parasite. So yeah, see you then.